Proverbs one twenty two. Ad matai petayim te ehavu fati. Veleitzim latzon hamadu lahim. U keselim yisna u daat. So if we go back and get a full translation here, I have tried to move this over a little bit, you can see, in order to uh, see some of the gapping, but we'll look at that in just a moment. We have Ad Matai, until when, O simple ones, will you love simplicity, or being simple, if we see this as a characteristic of the simple ones. And this is the gapped part, so and how long the score Scoffers, scoffing for themselves or scoffing to them, the scoffing that belongs to them, they delight, and fools, foolish ones, they will hate knowledge. So let's go iron that out just a little bit. Here is the when or matai. Ad matai is when, uh, until when, or what we might get is the interrogative then, how long? And that gets repeated, I think, in each of these gapped areas. How long, O oh, simple ones? There's our vocative, meaning it's just the address. And then we get the verb here. The verb is from the root ahav. That is the root to love. We've got the tav performative and the u at the end. So we're looking at an imperfect 2MP. O oh, simple ones, will you love? Will you love simplicity or being simple? Next, we get the scoffers. Here's an adjective referring to those who are scoffing, but it uh, becomes the substantive noun, the scoffers. Scoffing that belongs to them. This is a lament of possession. They will delight in. Here is a call perfect, 3CP, of the root hamad to take delight in. And then finally, we come back here to the foolish ones, or the fools, the insolent, again gapped here. How long uh, will the foolish ones, will they hate knowledge? The verb here is the call imperfect 3MP of the root sana, or sane, to hate. And so you get these groups, the simple ones, the scoffers, and the fools, all who the question is, how long are you going to act simple and scoffing and foolish by rejecting knowledge?